Welcome to Tech Tip Tuesday. Today we're going to talk about troubleshooting the improved Army Space Heater Type 1 or IS-2, specifically the flame safeguard control. First, let's disconnect the power. Then, remove the access cover. The flame safeguard control monitors the operation of the IS-2. When the IS-2 is plugged into the power, the flame safeguard control performs a self-check and illuminates the indicators. If the lights do not illuminate, check the power to the flame safeguard control in accordance with the TM Work Package 122. After the self-check, the flame safeguard control will go into active monitoring. Check the flame safeguard control to see if the green light is illuminated. If the green light is on, this means the flame sensor is seeing light or is defective. If the light is on before you turn the heater on, the heater will not try to start. Next, let's make sure that the flame safeguard control is not tripped. If the red light is on or flashing, press and hold the lens down for 15 seconds. Lastly, let's test fire the heater and make sure it operates properly and is fully mission capable. Put the cover on, plug it in, and operate in emergency mode. Verify the burner fires and ensure that there are no fault lights. By the way, did you know that you can get mission critical parts in our FMC packs? This will get you out of trouble should you need a part in the field. We have Level 1 and Level 2 FMC packs that contain the parts you need. And that wraps up today's installment of Tech Tip Tuesday. We hope you found it helpful. Look for more tech tips on all HTT products.